Welcome. Today, we'll be going through question seven from the Switzerland Maths Olympiad 2010. Let M and N be natural numbers such that M plus N plus one is prime and divides T multiplied by M squared plus N squared minus one. Prove that M must be equal to N. Please pause the video here and have a think about the problem on your own before proceeding to the hints and solutions. Hint number one, try rewriting two multiplied by m squared plus n squared minus one to include m plus n plus one, as this may help simplify the problem. Hint number two, notice that if a divides b, then a must be less than or equal to b because b is a multiple of a and so must be greater or equal to a. Hint number three. Try considering m plus n plus one squared m plus n plus one multiplied by m plus n minus one and m plus n plus one multiplied by m plus n. Hint number four. What is t multiplied by m squared plus n squared minus one minus m plus n plus one multiplied by m plus n minus one? Solution. So we have that m plus n plus one divides t multiplied by m squared plus n squared minus one. Now, notice that m plus n plus 1 multiplied by m plus n minus 1 is equal to m plus n squared minus 1, which is m squared plus 2mn plus n squared minus 1. Now, if we add m squared minus 2mn plus n squared to this, we get 2 multiplied by m squared plus n squared minus 1. And so 2 multiplied by m squared plus n squared minus 1 is equal to m plus n plus 1 multiplied by m plus n minus 1 plus m minus n squared. So what we have is that m plus n plus 1 divides m plus n plus 1 multiplied by m plus n minus 1 plus m minus n squared. Now, because m plus n plus 1 divides m plus n plus 1 multiplied by m plus n minus 1, because m plus n plus 1 divides m plus n plus 1, we have that either m minus n squared is equal to 0, and so m equals m, or m plus n plus 1 divides m minus n squared. If m is equal to n, then m plus n plus 1 divides m plus n plus 1 multiplied by m plus n minus 1 for any n. So we are left to show that m plus n plus 1 cannot divide m minus n squared, and this would imply that m must equal m. So because m plus n plus 1 is prime and divides m minus n squared, it must be a prime factor of m minus n squared. Now the prime factors of m minus n squared are the same as the prime factors of m minus n. And so m plus n plus one divides m minus n. But this means that m plus n plus one must be less than or equal to m minus n, which cannot be true since m and n are natural numbers. So we get a contradiction, and so m must equal n, which is what we needed to prove. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to drop a comment in the comments down below, and see you next time.